Hey, what's up guys? Here's a quick video I did doing some speed tests on iOS 13. Is it really worth upgrading? Well, the results were not what I was expecting. Now, let me just explain what I did. Starting out, I first did some tests, testing the app's launch speed. Now, Apple claims apps launch twice as fast on iOS 13 compared to iOS 12, and on first take, that seemed to be true. I would say three out of four stock apps launched faster on iOS 13 than iOS 12, with a few outliers like Apple TV. So with these varied results from app to app, I went ahead and just ran through all of the apps on the home screen just to get a general result. How fast does all of the apps load on iOS 13 compared to iOS 12? And here's the results I got. iOS 13 finished in this amount of time and iOS 12 finished in this amount of time. Now, secondly, Apple claimed Face ID was faster, roughly 30% on iOS 13, and I will say out of all the tests, that one held pretty true to its name. Now, after this, I started testing some third-party apps, big games like Fortnite, and sure enough, it launched faster on iOS 13. After that, I moved to more third-party apps, and here's where every single app launched faster. YouTube, Twitter, Venmo, Amazon, even iWork and iLife apps like GarageBand, iMovie, Kino, and Pages all loaded faster. And at this point in time, I was just going to finish the video off with a final speed test comparing iOS 12 to iOS 13. And here's what we got, pretty much a faster single core score, but a slower multi-core score. Now, here's where I ran into a big problem that I wanted to share with everyone. When I went back to start the speed test a second time, almost every single application was no longer loaded on iOS 13. Compared to iOS 12, most applications were. So it seems like iOS 13 launches apps faster, but it doesn't keep as many of them open for quite as long as iOS 12 did. Kind of a bummer there. Furthermore, I found this kind of weird. When I ran an internet speed test over Wi-Fi, iOS 13 always got better results. Now we're using the same phones here, same speed test application, same server, same Wi-Fi network, and the weird part was the speed difference was pretty significant. Not sure what was going on there, but just something I thought I would share to see if others were getting the same results. Anyway, concluding this video in the end, iOS 13 seems to be a pretty worthwhile upgrade. Face ID, internet speeds, and app launches are all faster. Only downside is not as many apps stay open in the background. Anyway, let me know what you guys think of the results down below. Thank you all so much for watching. Stay tuned for more awesome content, but until next time, this is Tony, signing out.